Okay, we're going out to a new airfield. Our friend John invited us to come down. He lives in Herman, Herman Missouri. It's about an hour away from where we live. Looks like it's out in the middle of the farm fields, but there's supposedly a real airport out here that flies real airplanes, and they let them fly remote control airplanes. So we're going to go out here and check it out. Might be a good place to fly our crazy speed planes and stuff. So we'll do a little more video when we get there. Okay, we're pulling up. I think those are the airport buildings over there. So, getting there. Nice and big and open. Hey everyone, this is Paul from Darcy Phone Fighters. Hey, we're out um, near Herman, Missouri. Um, flying with my friend John. He invited us to come out to fly with him. Uh, so, I'm, first I'm going to take up my four swept wing uh, plane. Well, my friend Chris's plane that I still haven't shipped to him. So, here we go. Let's see what happens. Let's get out of here. Let's see how it's Okay, here we go. over there. What are you? <laughs> okay, hey, we got my friend John here. He built the uh, Foam Fighter 22 um, with his own color scheme here. Um, what do you think about the uh, build on this one, John? It, it was a very nice build. It was actually one of the better builds I've built. Uh, plans were well drawn out. Uh, very easy to build from. It's a nice build. One of my favorite builds so far. Okay. Yeah, we can't wait till uh, you get to fly this one and see how it flies. It looks like you did a very good job on the taping and everything. And yeah, me and Frank are both very anxious to see how it flies. Hopefully, we'll get a maiden flight on it this week. Okay, that'll be great. And then uh, when John does, we'll put a link to his video. Thanks, John. Uh huh. Okay, we got my friend John here again. He's showing off his uh, EPP F22 that he built, kind of his own design. Uh, what uh, motor are you running on this, John? It's got the uh, Grayson Hobby Super Mega Park Jet. Running a uh, six by five point five. It's entirely EPP, full fuse with a foam board undercarriage. And that looks like it has a KF4 on there. Yes, it is. Airfoil? A KF4 airfoil. 
Many thanks to Dick Klein for the Yes, yeah. Me and Frank are very uh, thankful for Dick Klein and all the uh, help he's given us also. Super, he's, super nice guy and super helpful if you ever have any questions. Yes, he's answers. great. So how does this uh, plane fly in your opinion? Uh, it flies better than I expected for my first design. Uh, very floaty, slows down real nice and gets up to speeds that until recently I had never hit in a plane. Yeah, so. yeah it looked like it uh, was flying fairly well. Um, I believe Tom got some video so hopefully we can uh, make some video in after this. We're going to try one more flight with it today. Okay, we'll try and get some more video. Thanks. Uh -huh. Okay, we're out here at uh, the Herman Airport, I guess. This is uh, Mike nice. Maddox, and he's uh, showing us one of the airplanes out here. This is just a real small airport, but it's pretty cool. Mike's going to show us the real airplane, so, <laughs> other than our little toys. Oh, there's Tom, she's posing, wants to be the model. Raise up here. Okay. So what type of plane is this, Mike? Aero Commander. Aero Commander. 74. 74. So what type of motors are in this thing? Uh, they're, I, think, I think they're 380 horse. 380 horses. It's a dual motor plane. He said it holds seven passengers. Yep. Uh, what, do you know what the, uh, I guess, the speed is of this? The average cruising uh, speed? We're running, Aero Commanders will run probably around, right around 200. 200 miles an hour? Yeah, that's just a guess. Yeah, just a guessing. Okay, that's cool. Well, thanks a lot for showing us. That's so cool. Let's see. Let's take a look at the cockpit. Wow. Pretty someday, awesome. Someday, man. Yeah, someday we'll fly the real thing. There you go. That's hey. one of our goals. <laughs> Sorry. All right. We can follow Mike's footsteps. Okay, our new pilot. I don't know if I'll trust this pilot to fly me anywhere, but uh, looks like she's having fun. <laughs> You're on. Okay. Yeah, you can take it all. You can take a whole bunch of them. <laughs> okay, I think Frank's got a new air chauffeur. Got Indiana Jones in the back here. What is that? Jones is off on another adventure. <laughs> okay, we got John and his friend Tim out here flying their planes. Tim's got a flying wing. Looks like the rain's getting ready to hit us. So, uh, I don't know how much more flying time we're gonna have. Oh, there we go. Okay, this is Tim's plane. So he's coming in for a landing. Oh, nice landing. Done. Hey guys, it's Paul. That's pretty much the end of the video for this week. Um, I'd just like, again like to thank uh, John and his friend Tim for inviting us out to go fly with them and also their wives. They're all very nice people um, and it was great. We had a great time flying with them and uh, it's a great airfield. I'm sure we're going to be going back down there to uh, do some more flying with them when we get a chance. And I think it'll be a good place to um, take our uh, new future uh, speed planes and maybe some big planes. And also I'd like to thank uh, Mike for uh, showing us the real airplane. That was uh, very nice for him. We had a lot of fun uh, looking at the plane. Anyway, thanks a lot for joining us this week for this uh, week's video. Um, hope you come back and also subscribe. Take care. Hey, one last note. Um, just wanted to remind everybody to sign up for the uh, July 2009 drawing. Again, we'll be uh, doing the drawing at the end of the month uh, during the last week of July. So if you haven't entered your name, um, please enter the drawing. and. Uh, who knows, you might just win a uh, motor and a speed controller combo package prize. <laughs>